Hey, Typeform users. Today we are going to talk about workflows. Workflows in Typeform are where you can set up all of your customizations and automations in one place. So it's where you can add logic and branching, calculations and variables, URL parameters, set up follow-up messages, webhooks, and connect with other tools. So these are all familiar features. The only difference is that now you can easily access them all in one place under the Workflows tab. So let's take a quick look and see what you can do from here. Okay, so here you can see we are in the Workflow Builder. You can see on the top, you have this navigation bar for some of these key functionalities in your Workflow Builder. If you want to add branching or calculations, you'll click Branching. And same as before, you'll be able to start adding logic rules or calculations to your form. And as always, you can also drag and drop nodes within your logic map to set up your logic rules. If you want to add a score quiz, you can do that under scoring, which lets you assign point values to questions. So if you want to keep things simple and don't need to add any in-depth calculations or variables, then scoring is the best way to do that. And if you want to assign answers to endings and to create an outcome quiz, you can do that by clicking here. So here I'm assigning answers to endings. If you want to add variables to your form, you can do that by clicking the variables icon here. This is where you'll see your default variables like price, score, and segmentation, and where you can also add your own custom variables. If you want to add URL parameters to personalize your form or add something like source tracking, you can do that by clicking here. Again, you'll see some of the more popular URL parameters already here, but you can add your own by clicking add new parameter. Next, if you want to send a follow-up message to your respondents or yourself or your team, once a form has been submitted, you can do that in the messages section here. Once you click on the icons, you can start setting up your triggers and actions. Finally, on the side here, you'll be able to add webhooks and integrations. So with integrations, you will see some of the more popular ones here, or you can connect a different one by clicking the plus sign. Once your integration is set up, you'll be able to see it here. You can also always go to the connect panel to set up or check out your integrations. You can also preview your form here to do things like check the logic flow, go back to a previously published version of your form, or check your form settings from here. So you're not having to go back to the content tab to do any of that, but you can still access all of these from the content tab too. So that's the workflow builder. It's like the brain of your type form where you have all of your customizations and automations under one roof to help you simplify your data collection and routing. So for more tips and step-by-step -step guides on how to use all of these features and functionalities in Typeform, make sure to check out our Typeform Help Center. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more content just like this.